to Ryan a bit of a heartbreaking result today. Obviously disappointing to have, have lost the chance to win the league. But you know, overall, looking back on, on the season, it, it's been a, a good season overall, hasn't it? Despite the final hurdle being still more upon. Yeah, I mean, it's been. Listen, it's, we're all disappointed. Um, but you know, on the whole, it's been a good season in terms of you know getting the boys into the first team. You know, being around the first team. You know, a few of them signing professional contracts, you know, so we, we have to try and look at the positives, but we're disappointed. We feel there's, a, there's been a chance missed and I personally feel we should have won the league. And the lads have sort of run it close right up until this late point now and, you know, how disappointing is it to have lost it this late on, late in the game as well? Yeah, definitely. I mean, we, 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 had to, we had to go for it in the last 10 minutes. You know, we can see the two goals last 10 minutes, but we have to go for it. You know, in a game where we knew that a draw wouldn't wouldn't be, you know, sufficient enough, so you know we had to go for it. Um, in turn, we, you know, we get done on the counter and we we can see two goals. Also, this season, obviously doing well in the FA Youth Cup, got an ECFA Premier Cup final to look forward to. You know, and as well as getting into second place in the league, you know, it's not a, a bad season overall, is it? Despite how disappointed we are. No, of course, you know, like we have to try and look at the positives. And as I said before. Now going forward to the rest of the season, you know we've got the, as you say, the cup. You know, and we have to try and you know finish the season strongly. Um, you know, we've we've got two league games that we have to finish professionally. You know, and then we've got the cup final that we have to we have to go and try and win. And these, although they're horrible experiences now, uh, potentially for the, these players in the future, taking that into next season and beyond. You know, can they can they learn from that and, and help that so that, that when they put, get, when they get into this situation again, yeah. the right result comes. No, I mean, we're hoping. You know, I've just said to the boys there. You don't want to feel this feeling again, you know, because it ain't a nice feeling. You know, as, as a player, I was fortunate I didn't feel it many times, but you know, I still I still remember them times more than you know when I was winning. You know, because you always feel it a lot more than you know because you're told to just you know you win, you get on with it. You know, whereas you lose, you know, you can you can dwell on it, and it's our jobs now to try and get the boys not to dwell on it. You know, and pick them up and 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 finish the season strong. Very obviously a very disappointing. Result? Can you sort of sum up your thoughts following following that? Yeah, obviously we're looking to win the league this season, and we've got the players in the change room. We know that we can win the league, but when it came down to it, we, we weren't good enough in the big games, and we've got to look back at it. Look back at it as a good season, but one that we should do better in, and we know that we should win the league comfortably, really. And that negative and horrible feeling that, that we've got right now, you know, taking that forward into the rest of your careers, um, you know, that can be can be used positively, can't it, to make sure that it doesn't happen again? Yeah, of course. Like we, we all know we're good players, but we've got to look back on this experience as a team and as individuals and see that like we can improve on this and look back on this experience, make it make us better from it. And this season still, as, as a league season, finishing obviously in second, obviously disappointing that we haven't won the league, but finishing in second still compared to last season when we were down near the bottom of the table in this league, you know, that's an improvement and that's, that's a positive that we can take yeah, out Yeah, definitely. Of. We really struggled last year in the league and uh, this year coming second is a massive improvement. It shows the players that we've took on this year, getting much better in the recruitments, like really improving this year. And moving through the season as well, from, from the start of the season to now, um, a lot of the players themselves have improved as well, so hopefully that improvement can continue into future yeah, definitely. seasons. Yeah, definitely. You know, we've still got big games to play this season. We've still got to try and finish second, and we've got a game at Bescott coming up, so we've got the players to win that game, and hopefully can get a bit of silverware this season. And as you say, that, that game at the Bescott and the ECFA Cup, uh, ECFA Premier Cup final, that feeling that we've got today, that negativity, hopefully we can turn that into a positive for that game and make sure that we do the best yeah, that we can and win that. Yeah, we've got a feeling today, and make it into a positive and best got to make sure we perform there and perform in the big game and win the game and bring back some silverware.